can I run a mini bike without an exhaust? I mean, I know on a car, you can't run it without an exhaust. I mean, you can get carbon monoxide poisoning. I mean, so it's very dangerous. But on a mini bike, an exhaust system could be just extra weight. So I asked the one person that would have an answer to this question, and that's the mini bike expert. I asked him, do you actually need an exhaust pipe on a mini bike? And he said, no, you don't need an exhaust pipe on a mini bike. It's just added weight. And then I said, what about the scavenging effects of the exhaust system, back pressure, and all that stuff? All that stuff is overrated. The only reason why people have exhaust pipes on their mini bikes is to look cool. Okay, but then I ask him, won't the cool air going into the exhaust port after you turn the engine off warp the valve? That's an old racer's trick. They'll tell you that you will warp a valve if you don't run an exhaust because they know if you don't run an exhaust, you will beat them in a race. Okay, so I guess the bike will run better without an exhaust. Yes, the bike will be faster and quicker. Trust me, I've been doing this stuff a long time. I know all the little racer's tricks. Well, the mini bike expert has never steered me wrong before. I mean, seven foot exhaust, three foot intake, JB Weld head gasket, no head gasket. We all know what happened in those videos. So I have this bike that did around 50 miles an hour in the last video, and I think around seven and a half seconds, zero to 30, with a 179 cc snowblower engine. So I'm gonna take the exhaust off of this, and we'll see if we run similar times. So let's pull this pipe off of here. Yeah, I guess there's a reason why the mini bike expert is called an expert. I mean, you know, people don't call other people experts for no reason. That kind of looks cleaner without the pipe on it anyway. No need for a gasket. And if it works out really good, I can pull these studs out. All right, let's go test it out. Shoot, she'll fire up. This thing feels pretty snappy so far. Wonder if the mini bike expert's right on this one. Again. All right, let's knock out a zero to 30 real quick. I think I have to do about a seven and a half, I think. 0 to 30, 179 cc snowblower engine with no exhaust. Okay, that's what we did. A 9.14. It's a little definitely slower from 0 to 30. Let me try that again. It sounds pretty sweet, so I mean, that's all that really counts. Okay, I'll do it this way this time. 0 to 30. No exhaust. It seemed like it got pretty quick that time. It felt better that time. All right, let's see what we did. An 8.48, 8.48. So it was a little bit quicker that time. Let me do it one more time just to make sure. Since I'm already facing this way, what the heck? Then I'll do a top speed run. All right, zero to 30. No exhaust. Alright, 
see what we got. Oh, an 8.15, so it actually got a little quicker. So, I mean, it's just a little bit slower. It's not, and it's in the ballpark. So definitely could make up for it in top speed though. Let's see. I think I have to meet around 50 miles an hour. I think in the last video, it did around 49 and some change. So we'll go test it out and see what happens. Actually runs pretty good. Doesn't seem too bad. All right, I'll take it up on the road here. I'll do a top speed run. This ain't no run too bad. Uh oh. Right when I said that it blew up. Let's see. Hold on, let me see if it needs gas. Maybe it needs gas. Oh wait, I think it's out of gas. Okay, we're out of gas. <laughs> I forgot to check the gas. Oh man, look like I'm close to home. All right, so we made it back to the garage. I'm gonna throw some gas in it and see if it still runs. Cause we wanna make sure the mini bike expert's right. All right, let's fire the baby back up. All right, it still runs perfect.
Okay, so the bike still runs perfect. So it runs pretty good without an exhaust. So zero to 30 time without an exhaust was 8.15, which was in the ballpark. I think it did seven and a half before. And then 49.21, so it's right in there for top speed. So the bike actually ran pretty good without an exhaust. That mini bike expert wasn't too far off. With a little tuning, that bike could be a lot faster without that exhaust pipe in the way. Yeah, the mini bike expert's right. With a little bit of tuning, I might be able to make this bike quicker and faster. He's a pretty smart dude. And another thing I noticed about the mini bike expert, he's pretty handsome. 